So with the 14th annual Michigan Construction Career Days, the largest hands-on hands platform in the state of Michigan, when we come, come together for Construction Career Days, we're recruiting all year long because you know what that means? That means that opportunity in all the school systems across the state of Michigan with the superintendents and the counselors and all the students that are within the school system, they need to know what we do. So we've gone from seniors all the way down to seventh graders, which is super special. So when we're recruiting, we're given that exposure out here for Construction Career Days to all the different grades. We're up to 4,300 students from 115 schools across the state of Michigan. Talk about growing the opportunity with Career Days. It's been amazing. It's huge. We can go out to the schools. We can do an outreach. We can bring pamphlets and trifolds to them, but I can't bring 50 pieces of equipment with operators, volunteers, put them in a seat, get the reaction, and it is the interaction that they get with our journeymen and our apprentices that are out here to be able to mentor them and tell them what the, all the opportunities are in the trade, plus to get that hands-on experience, unbelievable. You can't match that. You can't get a better career exploration opportunity than Construction Career Days. I just wanted to get the kids uh, exposure to all the different ca uh, careers that are available in the construction trades. You guys have representatives from all the different local building trades unions, so I figured it would be a good networking opportunity for our seniors getting ready to enter the workforce. They can actually see their future right in their hands. They get the hands-on experience, they get to know what they have to do for schooling, they get excited that they might not be debt, have debt uh, coming out of uh, for college, um, but it gives them different experiences. By bringing them here and seeing the, the multiple opportunities for them to be creative and uh, use some skill and become trained and know that they can make an impact in the world, I think uh, other than knowing that there's other options other than college as well. So I know a lot of our students, they always are overwhelmed with the thought of how they're going to afford college or afford the next step in their life. Um, so this gives them the opportunity to see that you know you can work and earn at the same time through apprenticeships and the, the kids have been able to actually operate some of that machinery, do something within that field um, to operate that so that they get an idea of how that works um, so that might spark their interest. I went into the back with all of that heavy machinery. I got to use the bulldozer. A lot of fun. It was a little bit more difficult than I thought it would be. But. The excavator, that was the coolest thing I got to see today. Because I wanted to get it, like, I've seen it on TV a bunch of times and I wanted to try it out and I finally got to do it and I'm happy. Uh, my favorite thing done here today was, would probably be the, to run the mini excavator. I've done it a couple of times, you know, and I've run some of the bigger machines too, but here today that's probably my favorite. So now we're back, we're live, hands on, more excitement than ever, right? to say, hey, I want that opportunity. I want to experience what the trades have to offer, what the operating engineers have to offer, and the, the pride that they get. You can see it on the students coming through. They lay down a good weld. They do a really good bucket full of dirt out here. They get that pride. That's what you get out of the smiles and the reactions from them. Just to show them the careers that are out there other than going to college and, and the livings you can make. Uh, you can make a good living being an operator still playing in the sandbox. Like, I know a lot of people don't want to get dirty, but like, it's worth the experience. This is a great experience for the kids, and we appreciate you guys putting it down.